The art of holding still. What does it really mean? Hello, dear learners. Today, we're diving into a very common yet fascinating English phrase, hold still. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly what it means and how to use it confidently in your conversations. Hold still is a phrase that consists of two main words, hold and still. Literally, hold means to grasp, keep or restrain, while still means not moving. So when combined, hold still generally means do not move. Imagine you're at the doctor's office and they're about to give you an injection. They might say, hold still, this won't hurt a bit. In this context, they're asking you not to move so they can safely administer the injection. Though often used in its literal sense, hold still can also have figurative meanings. For instance, if someone says, I can't hold still when I hear that song, they don't necessarily mean they're physically moving. They might be expressing that they get very excited or emotional when they hear that particular song. Like many phrases in English, the meaning of hold still can slightly vary based on the context. It's important to pay attention to the surrounding words and the overall situation to grasp its true intent. If someone is taking your photograph, hold still means to not move so the picture isn't blurry. In a suspenseful situation in a movie, hold still might be used to avoid detection by a threat. Always remember, context will guide your understanding. It's easy to confuse hold still with stay still. Though they can often be used interchangeably, hold sometimes implies a temporary state, while stay might suggest a longer duration. For instance, if someone says, hold still, I'll be right back, it implies you should wait momentarily. On the other hand, stay still until I tell you to move, implies a longer period of waiting. Understanding phrases like, hold still, enhances your ability to communicate effectively in English. We hope this explainer has shed light on its various uses and meanings. Keep practicing, and remember, the key to mastering any language is persistence and curiosity. Happy learning!